let's try and see how we calculate the volume of a cone volume of a cone is given by 1 over 3 times pi r square times h now let me just quickly discuss with you how every component in this formula can be visualized differently let's just focus on pi r square this pi r square basically refers to the area of the bottom of the cone which is circular and that's why it's pi r square and when we multiply this two dimensional area with the height h and this is the height so if you take up this area upwards for height h you are going to get a cylinder like this which will have the volume pi r square h right but of course the cone is going to have lesser volume than the cylinder and it's ultimately not in the scope of this video to explain how or why this is one third of the volume of the cylinder but the volume of the cone is basically one third of the value pi r square times h which is nothing but one third of volume of cylinder of radius r and height h let's try to solve a problem on this let us say radius of this cone is 21 centimeters while the height of this cone is 28 centimeters now how we can find out the volume we simply will have to plug in these values in the formula of volume of the cone so volume is given by 1 by 3 pi times r square which is 21 square times h which is 28 we can use the value 22 by 7 for pi so let's write it as 1 by 3 times 22 by 7 times 21 square times 28 since 28 is 7 times 4 we can simplify 28 by 7 as 4 and then we can rewrite this formula as 1 over 3 times 22 times 21 square times 4 which gives us 1 by 3 times 22 times square of 21 which is 441 times 4 and this gives us 19,936 if you compute this using the calculator you'll get this value and what will be the unit unit is going to be centimeters cube remember we are trying to compute the volume and whenever we are computing volume we represent the volume in terms of the cube of the unit of the side lengths and that's why the volume of the cone in this case is 19,936 centimeter cube.